Hey guys, it's Phoenix. I wanted to do something a little bit bold today. I haven't really done anything like this on the channel, and I hope you guys do like it. Sort of an experiment, statistical analysis. I wanted to give it a shot to see whether people actually implemented some sort of fish survival mechanism into Minecraft. This is a little bit odd if you think about it, but I really wanted to know whether the fish in Minecraft are dumb. Whether fish are able to find themselves back into water should they be outside of water. Uh, I do know, in fact, that fish eyesight is decent, although not really comparable to uh, mammalian eyesight. So here I've set up a pool, and I'm going to run this experiment right now while I discuss this with you guys, because this could take a while. Um, this is obviously uh, really just considering whether the fish can uh, find their way back into water should they be summoned outside. So all of these command blocks right here will summon salmon on the edge of this command block. So, the idea is as follows. The fish will either jump into the water or jump backwards. So there's a 50-50 shot at whether this fish will survive. It's literally on the edge. It doesn't look like it because the hitbox for salmon uh, while they're flopping about on land is not uh, really aligned properly. You can see that. So, I've, uh, I've done a bit of um, just chopping and changing and I found the exact moment in which the fish is literally on the edge but not quite. So there is some mob collision, but don't worry too much about that. That's actually important, so not really an extraneous variable, is it? So, we have on the right sidebar some numbers. Uh, N is the number of fish that I summon at each iteration. X is the number of iterations. So NX is essentially the number of fish that have been summoned <laughs> to their doom. And Alive is the number of fish which are still alive if they are about to die. So as I kill them with this line of command blocks, the fish that are in the water is the alive number. The fish that die, so the ones which are still near, is the dead number. <laughs> this is not as brutal as it really sounds. This is not real. Uh, and then the survival percentage and the mortality percentage are the numbers of, obviously, just translating into percentages here. So uh, it's all controlled by the statistics here and some operations are done here. This is all the summoning mechanisms, just the one on the left. So I've done uh, roughly 22 now, 22 iterations. And you can see the number of fish that have found themselves back in the water is 56% compared to 43%, uh, correcting for percentage uh, d decimals here, of course. Um, and mortality percentage is 43. So roughly 56% of fish will jump back into the water. Uh, and 43% will flop backwards. So make your conclusions from there. Um, I don't think this is statistically significant. I haven't done the numbers, obviously, because I didn't really want to do it in Minecraft, square roots and stuff, um, p-values. Uh, you guys can run it if you want in the, uh, in the comments. But I will leave this running for a bit longer, and uh, we'll see what the numbers come up to. So we are nearing 70 iterations, so we've got 57 to 42 ratio here. So uh, roughly about the same, um, probably won't change much now. Uh, you will notice that I have left the salmon out to dry <laughs> for a bit longer than uh, I initially did. So the salmon are actually flopping about for about a couple seconds before I will decide whether they are smart enough to uh, find their way back. This coy little salmon. Um, now, obviously there are different ways to do this, and salmon are probably different to pufferfish and cod, but I'm willing to bet that they're all the same, they exhibit the same behavior. So, if you were to say that they were, you know, smart enough to find their way back into the water, you'd say roughly like 65 to 70 percent survival rate. Um, 57, I'm not too sure. You guys obviously can leave them in the comments if you'd like to uh, calculate the p-value here. I'm willing to bet that, you know, margin of error, 57 is probably not good enough. So, my conclusion, tentatively, would be that fish in Minecraft are just as stupid, and they probably cannot find their way back into the water. So rudimentary, nothing fancy here, just really basic uh, experiments, just testing out whether the fish will find their way back. And it seems as though they probably don't. So uh, after 5.8 thousand fish have died for this, I like to call it now. So thank you all for watching. Leave a like, subscribe for more creative content. Take care.